All right, today we're gonna do something a little different. Making some spam on the Blackstone. So I'm gonna knock this out here. And I'm gonna cut this up into chunks. All right, so I've got the spam cut up into some chunks and I'm going to be boiling some ramen noodles for this recipe. I won't be using the sauce packets, although I will incorporate some of that in uh, as we cook it and we're gonna do some frozen vegetables. So this is going to be just a uh, ramen noodle stir fry, something simple, something quick, something easy, something inexpensive. So. Let me go ahead and first we're going to uh, brown up the Spam just a little bit. Uh, so let's go do that on the Blackstone. Using some grapeseed oil, that's what we had in the cupboard. I'm going to use some of that on here, actually quite a bit. And then I'm just going to go ahead and put this Spam. Have this on low. While this heats up, I'm going to go ahead and boil those ramen noodles. All right, that spam's starting to look real good. So we're going to go ahead and add some uh, frozen mixed vegetables. well as some broccoli making a good stir-fry dish okay. all right so we're just gonna let these cook up for a few minutes then I did boil some ramen noodles uh, three packets for about three minutes, drained them, and we're gonna add that to it to finish it off here. We're gonna add a little seasoning, and we're gonna have one heck of a uh, ramen noodle. Spam stir fry, starting to look pretty good. What do you think? Looks good. Yeah, I think so. It looks really good. I actually think we'll go ahead and add some of the seasoning now. So this is some of the seasoning in the ramen noodle. Now that Spam, it already has some salt, so I don't want to overdo the seasoning. But we're just going to add part of this packet. Probably about half. Mix this on up in here. And then let's just go ahead and add these noodles. Guys, don't they? Just go ahead and knock them right in. And I'm also going to add some of this. This is from uh, Barbecue and More Rubs Total Chaos Seasoning. Really good stuff. I'm just going to add a sprinkle of this all up on here. Wow. Yeah. Let's mix that on up. Nah, that smells good. It does smell good now. Woo. All right, so here we go. We got the spam, we've got the ramen noodles, we got the mixed vegetables, and now we have a, a really awesome looking stir fry right there. Don't cost much, but it looks good. I'm gonna go ahead and grab some of these noodles, some of that Spam, put it in here. I'm gonna put it in this one because not everybody likes stuff as hot as I do. And it actually would be pretty good if 
during the cook throw some hot sauce in here on that black stone mix that all up and i did cook this for about 15 20 minutes just out there getting the vegetables all good and done but this right here is only made in oklahoma you probably can only get it in oklahoma and it is a rescue dog hot sauce and this is a brand new one they have out it's called bad ideal it's got some scorpion in it it's got some heat i'll put some of that in here nice thick sauce look at that and we're just going to go ahead and mix that up in here that's going to add some excellent flavor nice yeah Ooh, that's strong the hot sauce uh -huh. <laughs> all right so we got some of the noodles oh, right there perfect noodles spam little broccoli Ooh, those last smell spicy. little vegetable and of course you don't have to add the hot sauce as i always say this is how i like it make it how you like it let's see how this tastes mm. Mm. wow that's hot Hey, they call it that bad idea. They haven't got the official label out yet. And I forget, he told me that has scorpion and several different peppers in it. I bet. It smells strong. And that is hot. Wow. Mm. Really a good dish. I mean, if you don't want noodles, add rice, fried rice. Do it how you want it. Turns out fantastic. I'm going to make me another big bowl. I am gonna, gonna add a little bit more of this hot stuff and uh, see you guys in the next video.